Uh, hi Claire, uh, this is Rao from H2K Infosys. We are looking for uh, junior QA testers. So we want to interview you today. So do you have a few minutes? Yes, I do. Okay. Uh, can you, uh, may I know where you are located currently? I'm currently located in Dallas, Texas. Okay, how is the weather in Dallas? The weather is beautiful, thank you for asking. Is it uh, too cold or too hot today? <laughs> it is just right. Okay, good, good. Okay, can you brief introduce about yourself, about your experience? Sure. I started my QA career as a junior tester with one of the telecom companies. I tested the functionality of the e-billing system in this role. I'm currently working at one of the major banks here in the U.S., testing a web-based application developed on a Java platform. And this application helps Bank of America associates communicate directly with uh, their attorneys. It also helps uh, the customers view and sign their loan documents online. Okay, good, very good. So can you tell me what are the exact modules you tested and your role and responsibilities as a QA tester? Sure, I will start with the modules that I tested. I tested a delinquency module, I tested an attorney module, and also a bankruptcy module. And this particular role, basically, um, I'm working or I did work on the home loan processing and tracking system. What basically happens with this particular system is the representatives or the analysts log into the system to check the delinquent accounts and validate the data and make sure the delinquent accounts are correct as per the requirements. If the customer does not make payments after 30 days, then uh, the account falls under uh, delinquent accounts. So what happens is they upload all the documents to the attorney process system, which is also known as APS. Once the attorney receives the account, they validate the data and prepare the letters. So as a QA tester, my role was to validate the verbiage and make sure the data on the letter is correct. The letters are submitted to the mailing department and shipping and tracking details are generated and letters are sent to the customers. Receiving and signature details are updated in the system once the customer receives the letter. There are many other processes involved, for example, if the customer does not respond or if maybe the customer files for bankruptcy. As a tester in this position, I was able to develop test plans, create test cases, prepare test data by executing SQL queries. I executed test cases, I created defects, interacted with developers to resolve issues. I worked with system engineers to configure the QA testing environment. And in this position, we worked in the Agile environment and I was also able to attend daily stand-up meetings. Very good. So you worked in Agile environment? Yes, sir. Okay. What are the tools used in Agile to manage the user stories? Uh, the tool used in Agile to manage the user stories is Rally. Yes. Okay, good, good. So how often the sprint plan is? Uh, two weeks. Okay, good. So you worked in um, any SQL queries to validate the data? Yes, I did. So can you give me a couple of examples on what kind of queries you executed? Uh, sure. One of the queries that we executed was to validate the delinquents data for a specific loan number. So I executed the query from the delinquency table. So an example of the query is select star from uh, delinquents where the loan number, for example, is equals to one, two, three, four. Okay. Another query that I worked on was to verify today's delinquents report. I executed queries from the loan data table. And this query that I wrote is select star from loan data where the delinquent date is equals to system date. Okay, excellent. So are you, are you familiar with any Unix commands or Linux commands? Yes, I am familiar with the Linux and Unix commands. I normally log into Unix using the party tool and the common commands that I'm familiar with are ls uh, hyphen ltr mm -hmm. to list the files, mkdir to create directory, cd to change directory, rm to delete files, vi editor to view and edit the files, PS hyphen EF to list the processes running on the server. Grep, which is G R E P, to search for the content from the files. And find commands to search the files or to locate the files. 
Okay, very good. So, uh, what are the deliver de deliverables we have given during the current project execution? Uh, some of the deliverables I have given are test plan, uh, test cases, test data, uh, defect reports, test results, and also test scripts. Okay, excellent. So, are you familiar with the bug life cycle process? Yes, I am familiar with the bug life cycle process. Uh, first as a QA, I log in the bag. I find the bag and I log in the bag. I recreate the bag. I make screenshots. I send it to my QA lead for verification. The bag is sent to the developer. I retest the bag once I verify that it's been fixed. I go ahead and close the bag. Okay. So you are familiar with like uh, the statuses like new, open, uh, fixed, closed? Yes, sir. Okay, okay, good. Okay, any other tools you used for uh, testing process? What are the tools you used for filing the bugs? Uh, Bugzilla. Okay, okay. So anything else uh, you are working on the QA side? So what are the other things you did as a QA tester? I was able to track the defects using the Quality Center tool. 